it's kind of sad to uh, see it end the way it is going to end, but uh, looks like we're never going to be coming back to this world. It's kind of sad because we spent probably days worth of time. Oh, more than that, this was throughout the summer. I mean, if you added up all the time straight, it would probably be maybe six days. Um, yeah, so definitely sad to see it go, but in the end, I think it's for the best because this way we can make a fresh start and start it proper. Hey man, just playing in the back. I know. I like to just move. But yeah, um, basically, we need a new mod pack and we need a fresh start. We need a new world. We need everything clean, stripped, wiped clean. And we've, it, it's been so long since we've been on here that this wouldn't be a big loss. And in fact, I'm looking forward to starting a new. And I think that our building abilities have, been, have gotten a lot better so that we wouldn't just have crappy. Let's like, look at some of the stuff. I mean, some of the interior design is pretty good. I mean, like, look at the ceiling. I mean, it's like all the same thing. It's the wall. I just, not only could we. It could be improved. Not only could we start better from scratch, but just what we need to do so uh the next time we'll you'll probably see us playing together like this is we're su we were surprised that we were actually able to play something together we didn't think we'd be able to make this until he got his new computer yeah <laughs>
So, here was the second gate under me. I can fly out and take a look. Yeah, just you Ooh, fly in. So fly not... in the water and just show them. So this was the gate. I think if I press it, it goes down. Uh, but the lever controls it. Look at their names. Uh, I don't think they're names. They have names. They did have names. Anyways. Um, oh, they're all gone, eh? Yeah, well, that's part of the reason why we're going to start. Oh, they got no food. Oh, yeah, because this constantly runs, right? Yeah. So this has been running for over oh, for a year. Anyways, uh, we never f finished. Well, obviously, we we're nowhere near done. But that was the Plesiosaur exhibit. So we're gonna kind of take you over to the Mosasaur. I think is the next place to start. We got these cool doors with molasses doors. Which we fi that took us so long to get that mod working. Molasses doors, but we finally got it working in the mod pack. Also, and this is a custom mod three. pack, so if you want to know what well, this mod okay. pack is, it's Basically, custom. It was originally a mod pack called Fossil Tech, but it wasn't very complete. So me and Lucas basically took the time out of our own day to take a bunch of other mods and fill it up. Many of the mods were broken from Japanese websites, such as the train mod, which is basically the one We wanted to uh, have a monorail. monorail system, and it was working sort of, but basically on my end of the spectrum, it just put everything to shit. If I remember, this is the big Moses attack, and this is huge. If you fly over, just yeah. This this was the, like the biggest thing. This is my big okay, this is this is gonna. This took like a long time. I don't even know if I can fit it all in. Hold on. Like, even I think the worst part would probably go in the walls around it. And then it's around here. We have this really complicated wall. Palm trees. Design. Everything. And then when you get to here. I am. So sorry about the sound. Mm -hmm. Part of the reason we wanted to make this video was just some good closure on this build because we wanted to wrap this up in a good way. And we just, wanted to show that we actually mean, had something going, but. This is not meant to be seen as a size of our first thing. And then we always meant to just show it off, but we didn't mean to show it off in an unfinished date, which we can't really So here you go. Kind of cool. You can look at the most. I don't. I don't, I don't think it's in me, here. Jurassic Park the game. Oh, there it is. The there he is. I think we named him Moses. Probably. And then we. Oh, we had two. Moses and Poseidon. I don't know where the other one is. Moses up here. No. Poseidon's somewhere right here. So this is like our. Okay. There we go. This is like our uh, lab That's fucking area. Um, so, basically, I don't know uh, why I walked around. We didn't have a around. lot of building materials when this first was made, hence why it's not very good, like rusty. I'd probably use more rusty metal. But, um, this is really cool about here, if you come in here. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, so I was at the, right, at, the, at the right side of it. So here's the door. Mm. You could drop down. And this actually opens up uh, into the Mosasaur. Now this is not symmetrical because I realized this awesome door that I wanted to use well, was a four x four, but this is built like a three by three mill. So it looks a little so off. It's a little off, but I didn't want to rebuild this entire fucking mill. But you open this. Shit. <laughs> okay, so you open it. There's a cool animation. It spins and opens. I'm not gonna place it, but look up. You've got like. A jar. Are you gonna place it? Yeah. Yeah, whatever. Open it. Anyways, it looked really cool. That's it. Here's, oh, there, there you go. Open it now. It opens up. There, I think. Should. Yeah, there. Yeah, and then there's like we can, black. and we would put on our scuba gear, which is right here. And you can drop There's, down under, which is where I am now. Oh, but yeah, you can drop in. And, uh, you know, someone with the Mosasaurus. There's Poseidon over here. The green one, and the Moses is over here. The blue one. But yeah. On to the next exhibit, I would say. Alright, so that was the aquatic section. And what our intent was, is if you open up the map, you see... Right near the plesiosaurs, is this big sand area. So, as you hear, want me to open just up the map? Just fly over. Okay. 
see over here, I'm pretty sure it's just a big sand area. Here. And we're gonna plan on doing the live Floridons and the um, ichthyosaurs. Which we had a map here. though. It was it all a nice, out. nice lagoon here. But, um, never Let's see, we rounded off right here, connected yeah. off from the ocean. We had these guys. That, but um, in our new park, which is the whole point of this video is basically to announce we're gonna be doing this with our own new mod pack, our own new stuff, um, brand new, fresh. On my, when I got my good computer, a good gaming computer, which I'm not gonna, we won't have viruses and crap on it. It'll be really good. Yeah. So here's the path that we had all lined out. And as you can see, here's some of the actual terrestrial dinosaurs, which we didn't get around to just, the bottom. Oh yeah, also, that the is awesome. Cheap, yeah. So yeah, we drive we're honestly going to reuse a lot of the mods here. We're just going to cut out the virus giving one, so that way it'll still run good. Yeah, we're not. We're going to get rid of the train mod. As you can see, it it, it was not working. There's better train mods out there, anyways, that yeah. do work. So we're. Anyways, one go. thing that we found that was awesome. It's Bibliocraft. I Bibliocraft. It is Bibliocraft. That you can actually put custom banners. So this is actually custom. We downloaded it off of the uh, internet from. It's like a PNG, and you can basically import it into your game and uh, put it on these little things. We have lots. Some of them you'll see are pretty good. Yeah. So we'll just we'll just continue on. And here's a bigger one. There's right a here. capture truck from like the Lost World. We just thought it looked cool parked there. Yeah, there's the Dilophosaurus cool. sign all awesome. We so, got lights under there so it would light up at night. Aw, oh, this is, like, you have no idea how proud of this we were. So These are just like right from all the Yeah. And it, it, it does its job. You actually get a pretty good view of the feeder. Once I again, remember, I, had, I even made a custom feeder design for this. And I built, like, a feeder for, like, kind of, like, from the first Jurassic Park, how there's like the flare. Let me show you. Oh, and yeah. the goat. Once again, we're sorry about the rare frame rate drops on Lucas's end. Holy well, shit. One reason you it's, see it's, that is yeah. because, once again, terrible virus mods here that we have to get out. And my computer is the one hosting the world, so it's a little like. But when it, it, we promise you might have to when restart this is it, all but... gone, it'll all, it'll all be fixed. Why am I so slow? I don't know. I'm just trying to limit my side of it. That is not what I wanted to do. <laughs> Why am I like... I'm like on moon gravity. Are you? Yeah. Okay. That like, might help. Oh, that is tiny, but... So no matter what I do, I can't make it less laggy. I'm trying my best. Yeah, well, we don't have much more to go. However, it is gets to the point where it gets really choppy, so I'm going to reconnect real quick. All right. All right. And we're back! Okay! So yeah, basically, all these issues we promised will be fixed. We used to play on this world with when the mods were all good, before we fucked everything up, and my computer got tons of viruses. We used to play on this world all the time, day in, day out, constantly, with no problems. More so custom signs? Come in here and show them the yeah, so these are more custom paintings. Oh, wait, show them, show them the train station quickly. Okay. This was just an unfinished train station, we'll show you quickly. Basically, this is the train mod that was fucking everything up, but it's really cool because it has like... It is sign. really amazing if you can get it to work. We got cool lighting strips. Um, but look there, at these signs, just look at that. There's the rail. Oh yeah, sorry. These are the rails, and uh, the train worked for the most part, but... And the Basically, track looks really stupid. We had a track design, but... We got ideas for new train mods, but if we can't get the train mod working, we're just gonna... Um, use the tour car system in Jurassic Craft that they're adding, which is awesome. So yeah, so we're gonna show you the cafe diner in here. So, pretty cool. I I really love the Dilophosaurus exhibit. It's like yeah, we we, we went all out. Donuts. Um, we got some pretty cool. Some all relaxing way. tiles. And here's the cafe. So uh, we have uh, we got a guy in here who's working the, the counter. Got a gumball machine, you can get, got coffee, you know, you got cake. It's pretty cool, actually. I really like You got a little TV on in there. <laughs> uh, I love it. It's pretty so, great. Yeah, there's TVs all in here, and oh, I remember. Basically, I'm going to explain this. On a single-player world, I had created the entire visitor center from Jurassic Park. That is the building that's under the archway right there, as you can see. Like, yeah, that big building. Um, I basically built that entire building. 
and then I accidentally loaded up the world without the mods installed and lost all the modded blocks. So basically everything disappeared. However, on that world, I was screwing around with the banners, and we tried to get this working on this world, and we couldn't get it working. But when I was screwing around with them on the other world, because I wanted this banner in the background behind like the front desk or whatever, I managed to get it working with like the sizing up tool. You like size yeah. it. It's really hard to explain, but basically, you just paint, put down the one painting in the corner, and then you basically put down how many blocks you want up in that. So at how many X you want, like so in this case, it would be two by four. And that's basically how you did it. But you can make this as big as you want. You can make yeah. this like a hundred. Obviously, like, you things. lose resolution, but. But you could also proportion really weird and have it screwed up. So basically, when we first put this down, we thought it's it would. Basically, the point is, this took a lot of fiddling with. But finally, we got it. Yeah, and we got TVs in here. That's all captured. And this is probably one of the best views you'll get. Yeah, don't from... mind the ugly monorail track. Yeah, we we did have a design, but we never got to do it because it was too. Terrible. Well, you can actually hear the dial off. No. Okay, so now we get to I get to show, you know, the cool theater. Yeah, Lucas spent so long I did countless single player uh, things. Our worlds and stuff. So we do oh, have yeah. like theaters and show stuff. Them the, I completely forgot about this. Oh wow, look how big they are. Yeah. We named, I think we named one Dennis, one Nandri, and then we named one Dylan. But here's the, um, there's a hatch for this somewhere, like a... Yeah, like a controller. So this is like a little den that they can go into. Yeah, we put we down some, some of the meat blocks and chisel. So I'm, gonna be, I'm gonna be right back. Yeah, so it kinda, it, 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 oh, there it's is. nice, it's nice. There yeah, look at them. Oh, I missed them so much. We're gonna have, to, honestly, I love these dinosaurs, just nostalgia. So when we get them back on the new world, we'll rename them a bunch of the, the same name. So up here, I believe it is. Also, another thing you have to know, some of the mods that are guaranteed to me in it, the Jurassic Park Vehicles mod, Jurassic Craft in its newest, best version, Fossils and Archaeology, Chisel, Carpenters, uh, the gun the gun mod, I forget what it's called. Basically the one that gives me this gun, this fast 12 that you can see in my hand right now. Yeah, no, I cannot see that in your hand. Right Basically, now. it's a really good gun mod. There you go. Um, the MC Heli mod, if we can find a good train mod, and then like deco craft, maybe little craft, and good mods. So basically, good functioning mods that we know work. Anyways, we'll just continue. Okay, I'm gonna be back again because I don't think this is working. All right, we're back. Hopefully, maybe. I turned my phone. I think so. Oh, what a guy. Okay, you can actually hear the pigs right now, and it's actually open, or is it open? So basically, what this is, Just get through this quest, I'm trying, it's not doing anything. Basically, this opens up and pushes the pigs up, kind of like with pistons. Yeah, just like the goat thing. Yeah, and they're able to eat them, and they do eat them and kill them. That's basically what I wanted to show. Now, I'm going to TP myself to you because it is... I think it's just because I was in that heavy area. area. Alright. So basically this was all gonna be covered. Do not, we weren't gonna use floating dirt tracks basically. This was all gonna be covered in like iron and I have, think like, we made pillars. a design actually. Yeah we did. We had like segments. So this just cool little fall, water feature. Quickly. Oh yeah, this just path was gonna lead there. This is gonna be a really long path that led over to a swamp. And the swamp is gonna be the site of the visitor center, and there's all gonna be like dinosaur mm -hmm. safari exhibits over here. Yeah, it's all there, yeah. Here, right here. In fact, there, I think there's somewhere around here's the block. That's not important now. Time to go back to the park. So we had like a really big scope, like a really big scale we wanted to do. It was huge. It's never happened. Okay, so the so next really part is pretty cool though. Like we could honestly follow the tra the track to the next part. Oh yeah, up here. I don't. We haven't showed this, right? Got a helipad. Oh, that's pretty cool. That's from the MC Heli mod, and that's one of my favorite mods. We have to bring that one back. The only thing we didn't do is uh, add a uh, lights around it. We specifically chose the one that the engine chopper. Right, that we just thought that it looked but so if you cool. Down here, it do looked this really cool. Train tunnel. So this is where the monorail. This is our design for when the monorail comes like a subway and goes underground. This is our design for the tunnel. We thought it looked pretty cool. It looks pretty stu subway ish. Basically, the thing was gonna go on a big loop, and this is one of the stations. Oh, in fact, one of the trains is in 
The station? Station. So you can actually see here though how the how the track was. I'm gonna yeah. Oh god. See, Half the train is gone. It's flipped. Remember when we used to play and we were having the issues? It oh yeah. Now it's Oh, too bad you can't see it. It's a pretty cool. So here's how the track would have looked. With like cool slopes and stuff. Try and hit it. And uh, if I can get into here. Which I don't think I can. Can I just fly through? Yeah, you can. The train's. So I'm gonna drive the train now. Hold on, don't do anything yet. Okay, so this was the station before you do anything. Uh, this guy kind of did your tickets. We got a Therizinosaurus, which brings us to our next point. This is kind of like uh, well, just a skeleton, but... We were actually going to have a big museum building. You can't on see, its own. but there's actually a roof and stuff. Yeah, it's, it's so dark. So you can actually Come on. peer over here. And this is a Therizinosaurus exhibit. We're gonna have another. In fact, I think we started working on a watchtower on the other side of it. Uh, if you look and just fly in, you can see the Therizinosaurus somewhere. I think. Yeah, there's, there's one. one. That's a so cute. Let's see. Yeah. Cute. This is the other exhibit. Um, the other big exhibit. There's yeah, another one. I like this one as well because it's got a lot of vegetation going on. It's pretty big too. So you're gonna fly or drive the train out? I'm gonna Break the server? Yeah, so it is obviously gonna, gonna that's be how we, that's how we gonna be. Video, just fucking destroying it, it's it's sad that you know it's all gone to crap to see it go like this, but it's necessary. I'm gonna miss our train. I'm gonna I'm gonna try to get it. Oh yeah, and also. Oh, wait, actually, I'm gonna, I'm gonna try to drive it. I'm gonna try to drive it. Not bad, no worries. Yeah. Oh, it's sad. And I remember, if you look on this there side. Go. Oh. God damn it. Well, we're not coming Just back. Fly up there. Trying. Alright, the point is. Oh, because the track broke, so that's why. Anyways. <laughs> yeah, the train mod is terrible. Um, on that note, uh, basically, we had a lot of high hopes, huh? dreams. We got too ambitious, and hit our mostly my computer was just not up for it because it was not. It's not a gaming computer. It's like a tiny little Acer that used to be the family computer. However, finally now that we've gotten to the point where we have jobs, we will both be getting good computers. However, his is already good enough to at least run the game. So basically. When our channel comes back in the new renaissance with all these new games and new quality and everything, we will bring back Minecraft Dinosaurs on a brand new series where we will record from day one with a great mod pack, great mods, great series, great builds, great dinosaurs, everything's going to be awesome. Be That's the dream. And oh, that man. should be in this like under a month's time. Watch. That'll be like a month. Alright, where are we meet? Meet me somewhere. Let's fly to the Lothosaurus sign, just because, God bless. No, fly to the, um, fly to the, uh, banner on the inside of the coffee thing. And then we'll end that in the background. Hopefully it doesn't lag to hell. It shouldn't. Now uh, there's the, continue the tunnel pattern all the way through. We did. It, no, it, it wraps all the way around. <laughs> Yeah, like the, that uh, tunnel pattern we've all through the mountain system. It wraps all, all the way. All behind, you see. like the monorail, Lucas, you turn your head. The monorail goes right behind but in through that mountain. All the way around. Yeah. Well, it's kind of sad to uh, see it end the way it is going to end but uh looks like we're never going to be coming back to this world it's kind of sad because we spent probably days worth of time oh more than that this was throughout the summer i mean if you added up all the time straight it would probably be maybe six days 
Um, yeah, so definitely sad to see it go, but in the end, I think it's for the best because this way we can make a fresh start and start it proper. Hey man, just playing in the back. I know. I like to just move. But yeah, um, basically, we need a new mod pack and we need a fresh start. We need a new world. We need everything clean, stripped, wiped clean. And we've, it, it's been so long since we've been on here that this wouldn't be a big loss. And in fact, I'm looking forward to starting a new. And I think that our building abilities have, been, have gotten a lot better so that we wouldn't just have crappy. Like, look at some of the stuff. I mean, some of the interior design is pretty good. I mean, like, look at the ceiling. I mean, it's like all the same thing. It's the wall. I just, not only could we it could be improved. Not only could we start better from scratch, but it's just what we need to do. So uh, the next time we'll, you'll probably see us playing together. Like this is we're we were surprised that we were actually able to play something together. We didn't think we'd be able to make this until he got his new computer. Yeah. So but, uh, it's a miracle, and he's actually able to. Well, if you walk. can see this from my perspective, it's the lag. And, and it's already drops, pretty bad on mine as well. Like mine is pretty choppy, unfortunately. Just but, because of how bad this. Um, yeah. Looks like the next time we'll see you in this kind of dinosaur world will be when, you know, probably in a month or two. Right about a month. So it's not too much longer to wait, but it is time, nevertheless. So we'll see ya. I've missed dinosaurs on the channel. We don't have enough dinosaur stuff on the channel. Cause yeah. like dinosaurs is like we're bringing the it back. Thing in the friggin' world. We're bringing it back. Okay, we'll see you next time. Finish, finish there. <laughs> All right, see ya. Goodbye. It's, kind of, it's so sad. I I, I can't. I can't. Just, just. Look at our dinosaur, look at our Dilophosaurus. Okay, one last yeah, time. This, this is how I, I want to do it on the way out. They will be reincarnated in the new world. This isn't the end of them. Alright, we're gonna do it. I'm gonna click it one last time. That's so sad. Cole is just disconnected as well. And just to prove to you how old this actually is, these are worlds from around the time. And you can see 2016. Those are all test worlds. In fact, you can see it's literally called Camera Studio Test. In fact, if you load that up. This one? It's all. I think that's your feeder design. No, this one's like to test. We had this like cinematic oh, yeah. mod. The this feeder one, test world is this gone. This was literally all testing for this series which we were planning on doing last summer but we never got around to it because that was before our channel got back in its prime but basically as you can see it's from 2016 yeah so about a year but uh yeah and it's also been a couple months since we have played minecraft so it was actually kind of weird yeah because it's been christmas adventure right, i think we need to end this video all right goodbye